Hello YouTube, I'm going to show you how to use my program to capture your music, your current playing music and to display it on your stream using OBS or XSplit or whatever you're using. Um, okay, just first download the program, here I'm waiting for it to be downloaded. Um, just to show that it works I'm using a clean download, a new download. And show in folder and extract it, I'm extracting it here, you can extract it wherever you want, no install needed or anything, just extract it, ok. Um, open the file, the program, GUI.exe, then you need to, uh, to get it working, just open uh, a media player, here I'm using Spotify, then uh, start some music playing or just select it before, it doesn't really matter, and start it. And you can see it's working, it's capturing. <laughs> okay. Now, um, it outputs in uh, a, s a text file, current song.txt. And as you can see, it does that perfectly fine. And if you press stop, the text file will be emptied, so, uh, so there will no be cluttered text on your stream or anything. <laughs> Now, to show that YouTube works, uh, you need to have it active as the active tab, like here. Uh, it doesn't work if it's not focused. Uh, I'll show you in just a second, but here it's working perfectly fine. It's uh, recognizing the music I'm playing from Yoris Mask. Now here, it doesn't work. You need to have it opened as the main tab. So if you press start now, it won't recognize and as you can see there's no currently no song playing so it's not working. Okay, that's one. Now um, to get Groove Shark working you need something extra. Uh, go to the OBS thread and get the Groove Marklet. Um, ok here I'm playing a song and as you can see it will not work without the groove marklet or whatever you want to call it, I call it groove marklet but ok um, ok yes get the groove marklet available in the thread of course um, there's a text box, expand it or just copy it all it doesn't really matter what you do as long as you copy it all call it whatever you want press save then copy that it's uh, it's to make it work uh, paste it into the URL bar and just save it and it will work now okay so make sure you got it right that's it then go to Groove Shock select the Groove Markler just, just click it once that's all you need to do and it will take a little longer than normally but um, there will be, it will recognize your current song playing it's not instant but it's just a few seconds so it doesn't really matter and as you can see it's working again see it's even outputting it to the text file um, so that's how you do Groove Shock and next I'm going to show you how to set up your uh, OBS so open OBS uh, here I made a new scene just for this. Open the program. Um, some music plates from Sonata Arctica, a really good band by the way. Uh, add a text object, call it whatever you want. I call it current playing song, current playing music. Then get it from a text file and uh, browse to your uh, to where you have the folder program current song.txt also you can configure where you want to um, have the text file okay and set it to white in this case I need to set it to white because it won't show on black and that's really all you need to do and that's how I got it working thanks for watching and leave a comment if you need any help or Want to leave some feedback would be really nice. Bye. 
and here to show just quickly that everything works um, on the stream just selecting a few songs you can see it uplo uh, updates pretty f pretty quickly and yeah see a few songs from Sonata Arctica, Nightwish, anything and for YouTube so to show that the web also properly works and everything so there you go it also works for YouTube that's it bye bye